Helloito, 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 helloito. Oh, wait. How's everybody doing? Let's see, I don't need this at the moment. Hello, hello, hello. Are you guys ready for some big ass nails? Hello, hello, hello. Did Mimi like her press on nails? Yes, she did. Hey. So I'm recycling three of my nails. I went ahead and did them stiletto. We're going to switch them up again just to give you guys like ideas. I'm ready for Sunday. Okay, girl. I, I'm not ready for Sunday yet. All right. So I'm low-key excited. I'm low-key excited to do my nail stilettos again because yeah, me urgían. The black ones were pop-up? No, 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 no. So, I ended up shaving the gel and the bling and I made them into stilettos. So, these are the same nails from the other day. I just cut these down, the nude ones, and I shaved them a little bit. So that I can do black still. That's why I was asking you guys on Instagram if you wanted me to still do Halloween or to do um, fall. And you guys said fall. I mean Halloween. So I was like, okay, girlfriends. Hey, Zule, How are you? I'm good. And you guys? Okay, I'm not a big fan of Halloween. Halloween nails, so I feel like I can get too creative with Halloween, but I'm gonna try. Hey, Zule. Ahora sí te va a picar. Ándale. Ahora sí me voy a picar el chiquis triquis con estas uñas, eh? Um, when was the last time that I did the letters? No, 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 no. I'm going to do them all stilettos, only that I had pre-shaped these two nails off camera because I was like, I'm not going to bore y'all with that. You're a beast with the sculpting gel. Thank you, girl. Oh, you got stuck. I. So today I'm going to do black and red because I know a lot of you guys like red. Raise your hand if you guys like red. So I'm going to teach you guys how to do, how to go from square to stiletto just in case you guys don't have any stiletto nail tips. Let me drink some of my coffee first. So check it out. This is my cafecito. Mm -mm -mm. Bomb. So normally what I like to do is just make like a V at the bottom with the like a cut in a V shape and then I start off like this like a little picket fence. You know this is like your guide to your tip like how pointy do you want it. All right. Sometimes I do it crooked it's okay. Whatever. We're going to file it anyway. So before I had my on point disc. Hold on. Where do I have? Wait, I'm going to use the other one. The other electric file. I'll use this one. 
So before I had my on point disc, I would have to do everything hand filing, but now you don't have to if you have one of these. So this one's called the on point disc. This one does the filing for you, and you have to. Well, I like to use it in a in a high speed. And it helps you get through your filing faster. This is actually the reason why I got the on point disc to my store. Because girlfriend, I used to wear stilettos a lot. And my clients did too. Hold on, let me lower it a little bit because it's kind of loud. I used to wear, put them, I mean, do a lot of stilettos. And your hand be hurting. So you could get the shape even faster. Ay, ¿qué so if y'all haven't got one of these, what you waiting for, honey? Come on. Join our on point disc family. You will not regret it. So I try to bring it to the point as much as I can. And then I'll perfect it a little bit more just porque you don't want to over file and then ruin your shape. I'll do it with a hand file right now. Um, does the drill bit work with Kara Sky Drill? Yes, it works with almost all the electric files. It's just a little noisy with the nail tip, but I wait. Pinky, don't get in the dish. Don't get in there, honey. It's my BFF. I don't know why this electric file stops. I guess when it gets too fast or something. I don't fucking know. Look at what are we doing that? Like what the hell, man? I got mine. Honey definitely helps once you get the hang of it. Um yes. In the beginning, it's a little, not weird, but like, because it's a different type of bit, you're like, what the hell, how do I do this? So, if you're a lefty like myself, you have to put it on reverse. Oh, no, I mean on forward. The fuck, no wonder me acting funny. It goes on forward if you're a lefty. I had it on reverse because normally everything else we need to have it on the left. I mean, if you're a lefty, normally you have it on reverse. But not with this bit. You have to have it on forward. So you guys could see it be acting different now. Like, all of a sudden, I'm on the last nail. Alright, so I'm just going to file this much. And then the rest, I will fix it with the ham file. So that was easy. Where's my hand file at? Here it is. Um, so normally I try to leave the nail tips as perfect as possible, but it's not necessarily that important to like make it super, super sharp. Um, but the parts of the nail that you do want to make sure that are filed down are right here. Because once you put your color on, you don't want it to get shaved off. I'm just going to make my nail a little slim. And then I'm going to blend the corners. And I still have acrylic on my nails right now. So hopefully if I do put like black or something, it doesn't come off. Oh, that's why you have the same left hand nail still. Yes. So I struggle to do my opposite hand. That's why I don't change that one as often. Normally, I change this hand more because it's easier for me to do. I mean, I still struggle doing this hand, especially like on camera. Because I have to um, pay attention to like not get out of the like specific angle. But it's easier than my, my left. All right, so I'm just going to blend this down. 
Oh, I forgot to... Did I ask you guys if you guys like Halloween? Are you guys Halloween fanatics? Are you guys asking me to do Halloween now so that I could give you ideas? <sighs> All right. So there it is, my little stilettos. These are actually long as books. Oh, fuck. All right. Where are my napkins? Did somebody steal my napkins? Who stole my mother? My motherfucking napkins. All right, I have a napkin right here. I wait. I need, I love Halloween. Okay, so I'm not sure if I'm going to do bright red. What do you guys recommend? Bright red? Like the putona red? Or like burgundy? What, what are you guys feeling today? Putona color or... Or burgundy. Let me show you guys the two colors. The Reina Red. And I'm not going to use that one yet because that one's more like fall. So I have two glitters here that I'm going to use because black and glitter looks so beautiful. The live is freezing. If your live is freezing... Um, exit the live and then come back. All right, so let me show you guys right here. Right now, we'll do a pull really fast. So this one is the Putona Red. I bet what part of the net? I'm going to put them right here and then I'll show it to you guys. So this shit is bright as fuck. Okay, yes, I'm going to do a poll right now. So this one's going to be for the happy face, the bright red. Let me just show them to you guys first. And then this one is called vampire. Is a deeper red. So I'm going to do a poll right now. And if you guys want me to do the bright one, the putona red, you guys are going to do the happy face. If you want me to do the dark one, you're going to put the crying face. Okay. Ready, set, go. And if you don't know where to vote, you just go down here. There's a happy face and a crying face. So for the bright red, you do the happy face. For the dark one, you do the crying. I'm going to vote for the happy one. Only because I like bright colors. Pero pues, a ver que escogen. Ay, pinches perros. Quieren que haga dark colors. <laughs> Y'all want to see the vampire, huh? It's almost a tie, guys. Oh, my God. It's a tie almost. All right, let me see who's going to win. Who's going to win? Oh, my God. It's literally a tie. Okay, the bright one is winning. The bright one is winning. Oh, my gosh. The bright color is winning. I literally thought the dark one was going to win. Oh, my God. How many more seconds do we have? Ten seconds. Come on, guys. Lock in that answer. Lock in your fucking answer. Do you want me to do bright or do you want me to do the dark one? I think the bright one's going to win. Thank the Lord because I want to be a putona today. Woo. The, the, this one. The, oh, wait, not this one. This one's vampire. <laughs> um, all right, so we're going to be using Putona Red. And this color will be in the scoops. <clears throat> we were voting on the red color. What tone? So we're going to be doing the putana red. Yes, honey. Along with the black. Okay. So I really want to see what this putana red color looks like. So I am going to apply it to my middle finger because that one has black. Um, Wait, when are you doing the scoops? The scoops are going to be this Sunday. So you guys can already start buying. A lot of you guys already bought. Thank you guys. So this is, I'm going to be using my number 24 Kalinsky brush because it's kind of hot today. So, so girl, y'all already know what that means. Your shit going to dry fast as fuck. So there is a little bit of silver on here, so I'm trying to cover it. I'm going to do like a little ombre. Scoop party. Definitely check to see if you were live. Hi, Portia. 
hyper shaky bean. It's raining over here. Can you guys believe that? So this color is definitely a putona color. Thought we was doing toxica. No, I was like, let's switch up these nails. I Loki was craving stiletto nails. So that's why I decided to change a few of my nails. So I'm recycling three nails from my last set. And I just shaped them into stilettos. So isn't that color beautiful? Hold on, let me just move my phone because it, I'm about to like elbow it. Mm -hmm. Black Widow, that's what it reminds you of. So I like to grab the glitters from my, um, from my napkin sometimes. And how to call it, um, apply them in the areas that I want the glitter to be on. I knew I wasn't crazy. Nope, you're not crazy, girlfriend. I was really hoping you guys would choose not Halloween. I forgot to add fall as an option. My husband was like, you should just do fall nails. I was like, I don't think they want fall nails yet. These bitches are set with their Halloween. But I was like, okay, what ifs, what ifs. So I did bring down the the ombre a little bit lower. Can you build apex from that type of acrylic? No, you cannot. You cannot build an apex with chunky glitter. Is not recommended to even try it. All right. So for my pinky, I did shave off part of the of the gel top coat. So I'm just gonna put a little bit of of red towards like the tip, like just a little bit, just like. Like, boom, 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 real quick. No special design. Just a little hint of it. And I'm just doing it towards the tip. Only because I could still add a little bit of clear to that. Without making it look like hella thick. You know, just making it look a little different. I chose the Wachona glitter. Okay, gracias, amiga. Okay, so I am going to add a little bit of... Of nude to one nail. This one's going to be for a spider. So I'll do it on my ring finger because if I put a fucking spider on this bitch, I could still work tomorrow when I go to work. So if you guys ever want to do big shit on your nails, put it on your opposite hand, okay? So this acrylic, I'm using Cover Pink Nude. This one does not dry fast. So with my big ass brush, girl, can barely control it a little bit. But don't worry, we are gonna catch up to it right now. I'm trying to be Portia right here with her one bead method. Eh, but I'm, I can't, I can't, girl. Portia's a queen at that. It's all about practice, huh? Why don't you hydrate or prime? Um, Because I already have acrylic on my nail. I literally just did my nails like a few days ago. Less than a week ago. So if you pay attention to my nail, I have nude. What's like almost transparent. Um, So I don't need it. I don't need it because these nails are not going to last me a long time. This is just for content. So normally the nails that I do are just for content. Especially right now, Halloween nails. This is not the type of nails I would rock. Personally, because I like bright. But I guess I'm going to rock it for a few days. But not for like a whole month, you know? Oh my god, Zulay fucking stuck my nail in my nail. Oh, Zulay asked how to make Mickey head stick to acrylic tops. Um, I will glue them on. Don't try to put them on with acrylic because they will come off. 
Oh, so talking about the Mickey heads, look, I have them right here. So this is what they're talking about. These are the little Mickey heads that you put your little swatch on, on the other side, and then you glue it to your to your jar. You're not supposed to put it to the top. You're supposed to put it on the side. I mean, you could put it on the top if you want, but I mean, you're gonna ruin the beautiful lid. So you put them on the side so that when a client wants to see a color, you just look at it. Because sometimes a powder does not look exactly as when it's wet. All right, so what now was I doing? Oh, the ring finger. Damn, it's raining. Um, I'll show you right now. I'll I'll adhere it to the vampire one. I think I have one, a vampire one. This brush is too big for me. Oh, that's a good idea. Pop them on while the acrylic is still wet. I didn't even think of that. But it only stick to the jar if the acrylic is wet, not to the lid. Because I've put acrylic on top of the lids before and it comes right off. So make sure you stick it to the jar. Let me see. Let's try one. Mm, what color is this? Oh, vampire. This one. So this will be the little Mickey head. I'm going to stick it here. I guess this lid is like smaller. Where the fuck is my glue? Or I'll just stick it with acrylic. Like Portia said. I'll do nude down here. Just a little blob. So there it is. So these are the Halloween colors that are going to be on the scoops. They look so cute, huh? You guys could even make your own Halloween charms and shit with these little Mickeys. When I was um putting them on, it just made me want to go to Disneyland. I was like, honey, now I want to go to Disneyland. So it's already drying. I'll just give it some time to dry and then I'll show you guys. Well, it's not falling off anymore. So that's what the color would look like. And obviously in powder form, you could see like, the fuck that? I would never have guessed it was burgundy, you know? So that's what they're for. Because I don't know if you guys ever have to stop and swatch your colors for your clients. So that way you don't do that. That's what those things are for. All right, so I'm going to add a little bit more. Ooh, you put them, you put some of them in my package. Can't wait. Ooh. Yes, honey. I don't remember what I gave you, Portia. <laughs> but definitely they are so cute. Raina bedazzled one on my nails last time. Damn, se me seco. Por andar viendo el chisme, I let my acrylic dry over here. Dude, I just made a fucking mountain. Look at my fucking thick ass acrylic over here. Zule, would you ever try doing Halloween nail art? Like hand drawn? Like a face and shit? No, no. I'll try it, but probably not on live. Because a bitch can draw. What the fuck, acrylic? You are just running right now. Why are you drying so fast? Trying to embarrass me in front of my public here? Well, guess what? You got me fucked up. Stupid shit. Sorry, guys. I had a flash flood warning. Don't talk to us right now. The acrylic drying fast. Every time you stop to look, boom, it dried. For real, man. Hold on. Let me take off the little bottom. 
Like, at first, it was running everywhere, and all of a sudden, want to drive fast? Like, bitch, make up your mind. Are you going to drive fast or are you going to drive slow? What the hell? What the hell, you stupid acrylic with your mind of its own today? Yeah, it's raining, so we got a flash flood warning. It's like, I'm going to work tomorrow. Fuck that. And just kidding. Doesn't certain monomers dry quicker than others? Yes, some of them do. But my monomer does not dry fast. So I'm going to add a little bit more to this stupid lumpy nail here. Um, Yeah, depending on the monomer speed is how fast they will dry. Um... But this acrylic does not dry fast. Like, all my little beads are down here. I'm going to add a little bit more here. Yeah, this acrylic does not dry fast. But it's kind of hot. And the weather affects the dry time. Oh my god, I'm fucking stupid. I was not supposed to make it that thick because I was going to put glitter on it. It's too lame. Fuck it. Put some glitter on it anyway. Alright. I'm going to add a few little glitters just like the same as the pinky. Like just a few. Who's having a hurricane? I don't know. In Mexico, right? Or something like that. Okay. So something like that. This is going to be my spider web nail. And then maybe this nail. I should do all red. Maybe. Should I do it all red or just black? Just black, 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 black. Damn, now my other phone is fucking going crazy. Or actually, I should do it all clear and put bling on it. Should I do it all black and then put red bling on it? Or should I do it clear and then put red bling? You get clear with red bling, see through black. Yes, red and bling. Red. Clear and black and bling. Clear, clear, clear. Black. Okay, sounds like another poll. So let's see. We're going to do a poll whether I do it all clear and then I put bling on top. Or should I do it black with red bling? Okay. Both of them will look really nice. So the we're going to do the happy face to be the clear nail and then the sad face to be black nail. Ready, set, go. So I'm going to vote for the black nail. The crying face. Ay, ya me andan ganando, pinches perras. Andale, come on. Balance the black, red and black. See through with bling. Andale, 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 amigas. Go black, 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 black. No, hombre, ya agarraron las pinches. Nur, nur. Okay, the, I mean, the nude, the clear wins. So far, that's what it's looking like. Clear one by a long, for real, man. It's like, what happened to my black nail gang? Hello. All right, well, let me pop up my, let me switch my phone now from the clear to the, to the, what is it called? The clear nail win. I really wanted the black one to win, but we need some variety here. Do black glitter with clear. I don't have any black glitter. Well, not like straight black. All right. Y'all, y'all going to see the vision. Trust me. Trust me. So how's you guys Friday? How's your Friday going, everyone? I 
Ay, Stacy, ya perdiste the votes voted for clear. I'll do it matte so that it looks fucky. Hot, got real good. All right, what can I say? What about you, girl? It was good. I didn't work out yet. I'm going to work out when I'm done with my nails. So it's been good because I don't have to do exercise. Fucking hate doing exercise, guys. I hate sweating. I hate being sore. So I feel like I can't get a lipo because that I feel like that's what it feels like being sore. I'm having Costco salad right now. Bomb. Mm. We had a fucking Subway. Oh, my God. Let me tell you guys my experience to Subway. So, we went to Subway today because my husband felt like eating Subway. And the girl at the Subway location that we went to. So, originally, we're like, okay, we're going to go to a different location today because... The one by my house, they always got attitude and they never have nothing. Like last time they didn't have no soups, right? And Patrick loves going to Subway for the little soups. And he was kind of like low-key sad. And then, um, anyway, so we're like, we're going to go to a different one. Okay, so this one was fucking worst. First of all, the girl that was making our sandwich was mad as fuck. For no reason. There was nobody in there. Well, actually, she was ringing somebody up when we walked in. But she had all kinds of attitudes for no reason. Um, well, actually, maybe she was mad because she didn't have help. Um, she, There was no other employees there. But anyway, the restaurant was not even busy for her to be that mad. And so she's like, what kind of sandwich you guys want? Or something like that. And then we're like, okay, well, we're going to start off with a foot long. And Patrick wanted the urban. No, what is it called? The fucking. The one with the cheese. The urban cheese or herbs or whatever the fuck is called. She's like. Oh, my God. And I did think of you, Portia, actually. Because I was like, Portia, you see what I care. Okay, well, uh, let me encapsulate the rest too while I'm at it. And then she's like, we don't have that one. And I was like, herbs and cheese, yes, that. Um, I forgot for a second. I'm like, what is it called? So then Patrick was like, oh, there's none? Okay, well, what do you have? And then she's like, we have Italian bread. And he's like, okay, well, I'll take that one. And then she's like, are there going to be any more sandwiches? And there's three of us in there, right? It's like, one of us, two of us ain't eating or what, lady? So then I'm like, yeah, I'm going to want a, a six foot or six, I mean, <laughs> six inch, a six inch on Italian bread. And I'm going to want a six inch on the wheat bread, right? Because that's for my mom. Um, And then how to call it, I tell her that I want the the chicken with the buffalo sauce, but I don't like my bread toasted because it kind of hurts the top of my mouth when I eat toasted bread. So normally when I go to Subway, they will warm it up in a separate container, right? So then she goes like, so you don't want it toasted? And I was like, no, can you just warm up the chicken? And she's looking at me like, bitch, how the fuck am I going to do that? And then... um. I told her, I'm like, well, normally when I go somewhere else, they just warm the chicken up without the bread, you know? So she's already like looking at me like it's the same. And no, she told me, she's like, it's the same thing. And I'm over here like, what, what are you talking about? I don't want the fucking bread toasted, bitch, you know? Um. So then she brings a little tray and she puts the chicken in there. And then she, I told her the other one was fine to toast. Um, these nail tips, you can find them on my website. They are the 3XL square. I just shaped them into stiletto. And so then I tell her that my mom's sandwich is also going to be chicken. But that one she can toast it. The only bread she's not toasting is mine. So then she decides to put my fucking chicken 
on no 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 my mom's chicken on my bread and then she proceeds to toast but i didn't notice because i was looking at the toppings i was looking for an avocado i was like where the fuck is avocado at? Da, 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 da. when then my husband is like hey didn't she just toast your bread with your mom's chicken <laughs> and then i'm like what the fuck yeah and he's like tell her and i was like i don't want to tell her like she already got attitude like you tell her because, you know, normally they won't get mad at the guys. So then we tell her, like, well, he did. He's like, um, excuse me, I think you put the bread wrong. You put the chicken on the wrong bread. And then she's over here, like, like if we fucked up, giving us attitude and shit. Like, oh, you didn't want it on that bread? And then we're like, no, that the wheat bread goes with that chicken. So she grabs, it comes out of the little microwave oven shit. She grabbed the hot ass chicken that just came out. And let's just say the other half of the bread was here, right? She grabbed the fucking chicken and just tossed it on the bread. And I'm looking at her like, did you just fucking do that? I hope you burn yourself, bitch. <laughs> Like, dude, why are you so mad? Like, we were we're so nice and everything. So I was like, what the fuck? And then, whatever. I was like, I'm not even going to say shit. Clearly, she is having a bad day. So I'm not going to be a Karen or anything like that. You know, like, normally, if I was, like, hangry, I would have already been like, fuck this place. I'm leaving. And then, so then she goes like, do you guys want anything else? And my husband hadn't even ordered his shit yet. So then he goes like, I'm going to take a blah, 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 blah. She gets the bread and she slams that motherfucker on the thing, on the table or whatever. And I'm like, what the fuck is wrong with her? Like, bitch, you acting like we're giving you attitude or something, but we're not. We're just watching her, you know? And I'm over here like, what's her problem? I'm like, I'm going to have to call her manager. <laughs> but then I was like, Nazale, she probably just got in the, in the fight with somebody or something. But fuck, man, she's slamming our bread and shit. So then she opens the fucking bread, smashes it with her fucking hands. And I'm like, damn, that bread about to be a fucking tortilla right there soon. Her man broke up with her during the shift. I don't fucking know. No lie. People who work at Subway has the worst. I had my days, but I was never rude to customers. Yeah, so then I'm over here telling her that I'm going to want lettuce and tomato on all three of our sandwiches. And she proceeds to grab cucumbers. And I'm like, what the fuck is she doing? I never said a cucumber. I said lettuce and tomatoes. So at that point, I was like, is she on fucking drugs or something? Like, what the fuck is wrong with her? Is she not listening? And then um, I'm like, no, no, no. Lettuce and tomato. And then how to call it? She's like, oh, okay. Oh, fuck. Hold on. Let me add a little bit of clear to this one because I did file the shit out of it. And... Yeah, so then she puts lettuce, tomato, and you could tell they didn't really have much at this restaurant either. Like, they didn't have much product. They barely had any cheese. They didn't have no bread. And then we were like, do you guys have sa uh, salads? Do you have soups? And she's like, let me check. And she's like, "We the soup we have, we had it since this morning. And I'm over here like, why would you say that now? I don't want it, right? And so then she goes and looks and she's like, no, we only have not even enough for one. So I was like, I was like, what the fuck? And so she, she asks us what else we want on our, on our sandwiches, right? And I tell her everything that I want. And then I know I was like, this sandwich is just not gonna taste good at this point like it was not made with love it was made with straight up stress and anger and i don't know what the fuck and when i came home my sandwich was 
it tasted funny. I was like, oh my gosh. My mom told me hers tasted funny too. You, you should have slapped the shit out of her with the sub. Mm -hmm. I was close. Nah, just kidding. I don't, I don't give people attitude. I used to say that because I was actually the manager, but the people what? The people be tripping. Once I had another bitch at Subway give me like hella attitude. I was like, what the fuck is wrong with this bitch? I don't want her touching my motherfucking sandwich. Uh-uh. I would have just walked out. No, I, I don't know. I was like... I don't know. I always try to give the benefit of the doubt to people, you know, like, okay, something's wrong with her. Something's wrong with her or whatever. Y pues, it was raining too. So I was like, nah, I ain't going anywhere else. Bitch, it's raining. Watching this after just watching a girl saying she found shit in her sub. Ew. Bitch, you lying. We got attitude by the our sub our sandwich artist or what what are they called? Some people don't deserve the benefit for the doubt. Yeah, well, and then when we were paying, she goes like, "Would you like any? Did you want any sodas or chips or whatever?" And I was like, "No, thank you" or whatever. And then all of a sudden, she started to be nice, like, "Bitch, what?" What the fuck? Why you have this attitude all of a sudden? Girl, let me see them nails. All that negative food and all that and negative energy in my food for real. So, y'all, if I wake up with fucking chorro, y'all know why. Like, I don't think I'm ever going to Subway again. This is the second time in a row that I go how to call it um that they fuck my shit up she wanted a tip no hombre con le hubiera dado el tip stay in school honey because with that attitude mm -mm, you gonna get fired from this job question is duck nails really coming to come back i don't think so Subway is trash, for real. At least over here where I fucking live is trash. Disappointing. That's why I started to cook more. Because everywhere I go, the restaurant services, mm-mm, suck. Was she young? Hell no, she was a fucking señora. I expect the... I expect the young girls to have the attitude, you know, because we all did. And we'd be like, I remember when I used to work at Jack in the Box, I'd be like, anything else? Anything else? Or whatever. And then how to call him, my manager would be like, Zule, there's no anything else on the menu. And I'm like, so? But I was trying to rush them because in Jack in the Box, it's all about speed of service. So it's like, why are you going to get mad at me? Why are you going to get mad at me for rushing the customer when you're rushing me? Like, uh-uh. Yeah, so I don't know what was wrong with her, but we're going to pray for her. Let's make this nail sharp as fuck para que me pique el culo. That shit happened after COVID, gente huevona. Pues yo no sé si la gente está extra huevona o qué vergas. But everywhere I go, people in the food industry just como que no le saben, no le saben. Oh, yeah. Did you drop the mac and cheese recipe? No, Coco Bunny. I did not. I didn't record it, actually. I'm going to record it next time. We were so hungry, ain't nobody had time to record nothing. Hold on, I have fucking acrylic down here. Let me take it off. Let me take it off. Hey, Zule. Hey. How are y'all? 
this nude nail made me make all kinds of bad choices over here. We tip in the U.S. Yeah. Oh, shit. I like to tip people. Ever since I became a nail tech, I started to appreciate, like, the tipping. Like, you know, when my clients tip me or whatever, I learned to tip working in the nails. Before, when I was younger, I didn't fucking know about tipping. I mean, no me sacaban no más al McDonald's. Like, I was telling my husband that he was the first one to take me to a nicer restaurant. I had never been to none, nothing. Prior to him, no más al McDonald's y al Jack in the Box iba. Y al Taco Bell. Yo quiero Taco Bell. Can't forget the lonche too. Mm -hmm. Record when you add sausage and cheese to the macaroni. Mm -hmm. I tip my local paletero. Oh, that's cute. We don't have a paletero here, sadly. So I'm just going to hand file the rest of my nails because they're really kind of like super sharp. Some places add their tip automatically, yes. Especially if you are with like a larger group. So I know Benihana's does that. If you are in a, a larger party, I think they add their, their tip on their own. If I tip if it's good service, but if they have a problem that they talking it out the customer, I what? Talking it out on the customer, I am. Hmm? I always tip whether the the service is good or bad because sometimes it's not even like let's just say if I go to eat to a restaurant and they give me like I don't know some fucking wet ass eggs and I like them fully cooked. I know it's not the waitress who cook my eggs, you know. So I still tip them. I mean, they get a better tip if if I'm extra happy, but I do. Do you soak off your nails every set you do? For the most part, yes. How do you live with long nails like that? Super jealous. It's taken me years to master. It is definitely something you need to learn. It's hard in the beginning, but it's not impossible. I used to struggle. Like, I have officially graduated, guys, to 3XL tips. Ooh, hoo, 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 hoo. Yes, that part. Say louder for the non-tippers. Yeah, ever since I started my own business and all of that, you don't know how far a tip can go for somebody. You know, like, you don't know their situation. Sometimes even just five cookies will go a long way for somebody. Um, Aunque they didn't do the best service, but I don't know. That's just me. I, I always tip no matter what. Question, teacher Dulay. I got a new nail drill. Why does it burn hurt when I file the nails? Um, it it burns because you're applying too much pressure to the file. Or it's going too fast. So, how to call it? Um, try not applying. So, like, let's pretend this is the electric file. You're pressing down too hard and you, you're not lifting it off the nail. So, if you're filing and you're going... Or whatever... You need to like file a little bit nee, 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 and then lift it and let it cool down and then do it again and then lift it like that. Yeah, especially the picky ass bitches. Anybody who's giving anyone a hard time, they should be fucking forced to tip. Oh, my God. I hate going to eat to places and there's a fucking Karen. Or whatever, giving the poor waitress a fucking hard time. And they act like they're entitled to fucking 
A1 service after they've been bitches and then they don't even fucking leave their motherfucking cooking. And I'm like, Felicia, get the fuck out of here. Mm -mm. So, yeah. Those are the people that should fucking tip. The annoying asses. That fucking ask for everything and are a pain in the ass. I order your white and it looks like Chucky, but uh, what? <laughs> like Chucky, but other one look good. You ordered a Chucky? Do you have Afterpay on your website? Unfortunately, we don't have Afterpay, but a few of my customers shop through PayPal and it, they offer the similar. Right, I just had a client um, do that being hella extra. I'm, I'm upcharging the next time. If you can afford to tip, don't go out. My fiance was a waiter and made $4 an hour. So relied. What the hell? Four cookies an hour? Okay, so since we're in this, in this topic, since we're in this topic... How to call it? Um, oh, chalky. Did you try mixing it? Try mixing the uh, the powder. It shouldn't be chalky. Um, since we're in this topic, so how exactly do waitresses um get paid per hour, and then they're depending on their tips or what? I'm like, Chucky, the fuck? I don't have an acrylic named Chucky. <laughs> I've always been curious, like, how that works. Mix it with what? With, like, the back of your brush. So you're going to get the powder and then stick, like, a brush or a little stick and mix it up. Because sometimes... The pigments and the clear acrylic are not um, mixed together in the jar. Yes, I'm in Texas. There are three cookies per hour and all the tips are yours too. In some states, they rely on tips. In California, they get paid minimum wage. Ah. Damn, I didn't know that. I didn't know. I just assume they got minimum wage. I guess because here in California, they do get paid, huh? Ya me dio calor aquí. Fucking filing this Humpty Dumpty nail that I created. Damn, that sucks. I don't understand why do a job that pays so little. Sometimes you got to do what you got to do. You know, what if that's the only thing that is available? I think I'm going to need my, my filing thingy for this fucking nail. This chunky monkey here. The minimum wage in California, I believe, is thirteen fifty. Oh, it's fifteen already. Oh, damn! I haven't worked in a real job in a long time, so I don't fucking know. Fifteen cookies. A ver, let's ask Alexa. Alexa, what's the minimum wage in California? So last year was 14 US dollars. No wonder my productivity low is low with my long as nails. But McDonald's pay. Yeah, so if you work for a large corporation, they pay higher than the minimum. The payment is less because you make tips, and if you want good tips, you have to give good service. 
This nail came extra lumpy today. Yeah, that's why I be like, damn, I'm gonna go work for McDonald's shit. So I won't do nothing like these fucking people. Mm -hmm. Some of these employees, not just at McDonald's, but in general, they don't be doing shit. I'm like, I'm gonna go do that too. As of January, all fast food workers will get paid 22 cookies. That's it, guys. I'm quitting doing nails. I'm going to go work for a fast food restaurant so I could fucking not do shit. In Japan, it's weird for people to give them a tip. Hi, Zulay. And that's another thing that pisses me off about some people is like, dude, you're going to come and tell me that my prices are expensive, but yeah, you don't do shit at your job. You technically steal. You're stealing time from the company. <laughs> Hello from Nalgas Guangas. Hello. I'm going to have to file this one a little bit porque no mames. Tengo un tumorzote aquí a la chingada de acrylic. Do you tip in Mickey D's? No, I do not. I don't think I've ever tipped anyone at Mickey D's. And they always get me mad. Yeah, Judith works at McDonald's. She's one of my clients, actually. People forget doing nails as a form of art, not to mention. It's a lot of work. Fuck that. That's why I refuse to go back full time doing nails. Fuck that shit. My body hurts. I never tip when I go through a drive through. Me neither. Most of them ain't doing shit. No offense to any of you guys if you work there. We ain't talking to you if you're a hard worker. We just talking to the ones that are not doing shit. Que están comadreando de mientras que que mi café se está reditiendo. Old people try to tip me when I work there. Oh, how cute. Actually, when I used to work at Jack in the Box, um, this man tipped me while I was sweeping. It was fucking hilarious. I was like, what the fuck is he giving me money for? And it was because I was sweeping. I was doing a good job, I guess. Do you have that bit for sale? Yes. This one is called the Extra Fine Bit. Bartenders be rude? I don't know. I don't fucking drink, so no sé. <sighs> okay, that looks a little bit nicer. Now let me just finish shaping the motherfucking nail. Yeah, everything that I use is available on my website, guys. Give relationship advice. Okay. So my advice in the, for a relationship is... A relationship is always 50-50, okay? Some people tend to forget that a man... How to call, like, a lot of girls expect a man to take care of all their shit, right? I mean, that's up to them. But in my opinion, I believe that a relationship is 50-50. You have to work together to have a pretty long, happy marriage. Well, not necessarily just a marriage, but, like, if you boyfriend-girlfriend. Like, don't be a lazy-ass bitch at home and send your man to work. The fuck? Especially if you're not gonna be fucking cleaning and cooking for him that is not no 50 50 i've heard people be like i'm gonna take my man's check um, and spend it and it's like girl why you gonna do that there's things to get paid or whatever right so i truly believe that we all have to put in the work we can't just expect our partner to do everything, like, especially paying, like, if you go out, oh, my man's gonna pay for it. Like, no, girl, fucking pay for your man, too. 
you can both split expenses or whatever just like you guys want them to fucking wash and clean and everything y'all need to fucking do other things that men used to do before like for example me and my husband we do we share everything we share everything as far as like expenses and things like that but también no nos estamos cobrando like you fucking owe me this because i paid for it like no 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 none of that bullshit you have to respect each other and i just like when people cuss at each other in general so that's another thing in a relationship i truly believe that you need to respect to be respected. So if you're over here telling your boyfriend fucking bad words, I, I don't think that's cool. Like, I, I say bad words, but I've never told my man, like, shut the fuck up or get the fuck out of here or da 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 So I just feel like there should be respect. And the most important thing... The most important thing is trust. You need to trust your partner. Because if there's no trust, there's no future. Okay. Um, The bit is from my website. It is the extra fine bit. That nail is taking you through the ringer. For real. I fucked up earlier. That's why. So... I need to file it and make it sexy all over again. You keep freezing. If I'm freezing on you, just close the app and then come back. But that's just me again. Suley, ¿por qué lijas tanto? How do you know you haven't filed all the clear code? So this nail, I made it more, um, como se dice, thick earlier by accident. Se me estaba secando my acrylic. So it became super thick. And so that's why I'm filing a lot so that I could get my shape back. So pretty much I'm just looking at my side to make sure that it's the nice thickness that I want. Um, I did shave a little bit of the glitter here, but it's okay because I'm going to put a spider on top. And if I wouldn't have put the glitter, I would have not encapsulated the nail. So that's what I'm finding. Um, I want to buy your 2XL nail tips, but I don't know what is best, C-curve or no C-curve. Um, most people like the no C-curve. So if you are a beginner or have never used C-curve tips, I would just say to get the non-C-curve. The C-curves are slightly more... Difficult to file. I'm using my 80 by 100 file. Que bonitas uñas. Gracias. Yeah, so that's why I was filing a lot. So the other ones I didn't have to file much because there's already enough. They're already kind of smooth, you know? Zule, thank you so much for sharing your knowledge with us. No problem, girl. Whatever I can help you guys with, I will. You know, because el chisme está bueno. And sometimes it's not even chisme, you know? It's just life experiences or things that I've been through, you know? Hi, Zule. How long have you been on for? Hi, Lori. Um, We've been in, on here for one hour. One hour and four minutes. Are you going to clear coat them or matte coat them? Um, I'll do only one matte. Probably this one matte and the rest shiny. Only because they have glitter. No, I love the other set. I know, girl. I loved it so much, too. But I can't be getting attached to my nails because... We got other designs to work with, you know? Oh, wait. Are you Zule Nail Supply? Yes, ma'am. This is Zule's Nail. Zule's Nail Shop. Zule's Toys. Ah, just kidding. Yes, ma'am. That's me. 
Filing is my favorite part, but so stressful. I love and I hate filing. I just ordered yesterday and how there are three Excel. I need that too. No, <laughs> no, Lori. I, so what I did, I didn't remove my, my nail tips, my nails. I just cut this one off and this one and the rest, I shaped them into stilettos. So the 3XL ones are not here yet. I just reshaped my nails. You don't have 3D brush not in a set? Mm, we have 3D brushes, but they do not come in a set unless you buy the, the whole box, that, which comes with other brushes. I see people talk about your products all the time. So cool to see you live. Ooh, yes, honey. I hope it's all good shit. Good shit. Fuck it. The good and the bad. Because even the bad stuff gives you popular. And eh, just kidding. I don't want to fucking be popular. Okay, I was like, just my luck. No, girl. I'll let you know when they get here. So we start off with the square and we turn them into stilettos. Um, I started doing nails, but either I'm not putting a lot of acrylic that I file very minimum. Um, actually, I noticed that a lot of beginners, I don't know why, but at least the ones that I have taught, they always put very little acrylic. I'm not sure if it's because y'all are tight, you don't want to waste your products or what the hell, but put more acrylic, ladies, especially in your apex. There needs to be a little belly, not flat like my ass. Because then your nails are going to break, okay? I was thinking that those were really long. I'm like, I need those. Haven't seen really long still. Stiletto tips. Oh, yeah, we have some new stiletto tips coming soon. But they're not here yet. But in the meantime, you do square. 3XL square. But maybe you just have a perfect application. I don't know. I just like to file. I'm marking down by the hour to Sunday. Who else is excited for Sunday? Yeah, so that's what I noticed with my little beginners. They always apply very, very little, little product. But I like my stilettos to be nice and sharp, like kill a bitch. Like I could stab a motherfucker with these nails if they try to like rob me or something. So I think that's what a lot of my clients like about me, that I take my time with my shaping, make sure it's nice and sharp and crispy, not looking like fucking almonds when they're supposed to be stiletto. Fucking hated that. So do I build the apex with clear? Yes. I mean, if you're doing nudes, you could do it with the nude too. All right, so I'm not really going to go in to my cuticles with the bit because, again, I'm going to remove these. So let me just file a little bit at the top part and we can get to the design. All right. I'm just going to file this one down a little bit only because the line of the gel is on here. You are lying? Yeah. Why? You're watching it already? Yes. Liar. Are you, we already watched You're lying. Yes. You better be lying. <laughs> or else I'm going to stab you with these nails. <laughs> I'm just Hi, Zuley. Okay. Zuley, are you going to do another online class? Um, I was thinking about it, but then I forgot. Like, I stopped thinking. Because I got busy with all these scoops and shit. So I'm just going to thin down my cuticle just a little bit. So there's not Humpty Dumpty. But I'm not really going to perfect the filing and shit like normal. Because again, these are temporary nails. They'll be gone by Monday. Depends what I'm stabbing him with. Nah, I know he was, I know he was lying. I knew he was lying. Uh, my online classes, they, they vary from topic to topic. 
normally they're really affordable my last class i want to say was 75 cookies all right so i'm just gonna buff my nails well oh it's because we're watching cobra kai and the new season came out today and i wanted to watch it earlier but he didn't want to so i'm just gonna buff these nails now how do you remove your acrylics? I normally cut them down, file, and soak. How do you remove without having a sensitive nail bed then? Or it causes to... You have to soak them off properly. Because a lot of people, they try to soak their nail off and then they soak it. And they leave a piece of nail and then they rip it off. Like, honey, that uh, that fucking no longer is healthy. You just ripped it off, you know? So what was the point of soaking it? So don't rip anything off your nails. If, if how to call it, you get impatient and you don't want to sit there as long as your acrylic is not lifted... It can stay there. It doesn't have to, how to call it, um, come off completely as long as it's thin enough for you to keep working. All right, hold on. Let me throw this dust away. Yep, you just soak for no reason. All righty. Let me, should I wash my hands? No. I'm just going to clean them with alcohol. My grandson watching right now. Oh, hi, Grayson. How are you? Zam, I have chopsticks again. Alrighty, so I'm just going to get my alcohol. Wipey, wipey. Yeah, I'm going to do them all shiny, except this one is going to be matte. I see that Nelta gripping her clients off. Ooh, no. I would never do that. First of all, I don't rip off my own nails. I ain't ripping nobody else's because that shit hurts. So check it out. They really look scary. All right, let me do my matte nail first. Damn, I'm a dusty bitch. I'm a dusty ass bitch. Oh shit, what did I drop? Alright, let me get my matte top coat. Where you is? I'm going to be using my super matte. Oh, Grayson is my son. Oh, <laughs> sorry girl. I get confused. All right, so I'm just putting the top coat on, and I am loving my not polished lamp. All right, let me stick it in the lamp. You inspired me to try extra long, but I do want to get one of the best support, that length or the same. Um, wait, 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 wait. Oh, you want to try it longer? I'm sorry, girl. I didn't understand half of your message. Um, Hey, question. Would you ever do an online class about how to price nail work? That's um kind of hard to teach. It's hard to teach that because it depends on a lot of things. Prices. You know, like I could tell you, oh, you can charge this, this, and this amount of money. But are your clients willing to pay it in your area is the problem, you know? So there it is, matte nail. Let me put it in a little bit more because I don't know how many seconds that was. So, like, I try to give people examples, but the thing is that you cannot compare yourself to other people and the prices because every city, state, 
and all of nail tech to nail tech charge different. So I'll never be like, oh my God, she charges so much. I could be doing that too. But is your clientele, can they afford it? Can they, well, not just can they afford it, but like, are they going to be willing to pay? Is your work, um, is your work equal to that pay, you know? Also, the quality of work comes into play. Correct. Like, I could be like, shit, I want to make a thousand cookies per set. The fuck? Fuck these broke bitches. Nice no, getting <laughs> But are my clients gonna be able to afford that? Fuck no, they can't, you know? So it's hard. It's hard to say. Because once you start charging more money, a lot of people start to not come no more, you know? So you have to be ready to lose clients too once you start charging more money. It's all part of life. So, okay, I'm going to do a little bit of, of, hold on. Let me, let me see. What the fuck? I have a little nail inspo from one of my clients, nails that I did on a one nail that I wanted to do on myself. Where she at? Where this hoe at? All right, I'm going to do it on my ring finger. So let me get my dotting tool again. When are you restocking your white spider gel? It says it's out of stock. Oh shit, hold on. Let me put it right here. We should have it in stock. All right, so I'm gonna do a little bit of spider on here. A little spider jam, a little spider jam moment. You know, this is my web. This is my favorite thing to do now. Spider jam for your nail, honey. I might a little bit to my thumb too, just to kind of change it up a little bit. So there's the design. Let me cure this in the lamp. Since I'm wrapping it around, there's a little bit of gel on the bottom. So that's what I'm going to clean. So I put way more on this one than I did on the ring finger. Only because that one is like a... It's going to be my spider, spider web. This one's just like a decor. So let me... This on again, and I was playing around with my spider gel the other day. Check it out, right now it's a little dusty, but so I was playing around to see if I could put like color on it. So, if you guys want to do like different colors, I tried it with acrylic while it is tacky, I dabbed it on with a brush, but I think it'll probably work better if you have like an applicator. And um, you put the color on, so that's how I made it kind of red with with what is it called? With the acrylic. Not into fall nails, really. You you Paige, you don't like fall nails. How do you balance your nail life and your personal life? To be honest, I don't really have a personal life. I'm always working. I am a workaholic. Um, but if you mean like with my personal family, like I don't have friends, I don't go out with nobody. I don't like doing that. That's a low key waste of time for me because I just like to work. But sometimes I'm like, Zule, you need to fucking go somewhere. So then I'll go to the casino and some shit, you know? Fall colors have grown on me. Me too as a senora. The colors are so dull. I used to think that too, but wait until 
I show you guys fall. I love fall. Same. I feel like everything outside of work is a waste of time. Right? I thought it was just me, but I guess we're just workaholics. Like, I don't even like watching TV that much. I feel like it's a waste of my time. But I force myself to do it. I force myself to watch TV. I'd rather be working, making something, doing something. All right. So let me see. I'm going to do a spider with my spider gel. I mean, with my spider, with my sculpting gel, because I already know people are going to be like, what you do it with your, with your, let me just leave my lamp up here. With your, 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 with your, where the hell? Where the hell is my shit? I also used to hate fall, guys. But the Senora life in me is just changing my my the things that I like. Oh, my God. You stupid kid. Come over here. All right. Maybe I should seal in the... the, 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 the. So the spider gel remains sticky. Fuck, I got a little red on here. I'm just going to seal it in already because I don't want anything else to get stuck to it. So I'm just going to top coat it. Just going to top coat the whole fucking nail while I'm at it. I can't wait to do fall nails. I was already going to start, but then I was like, no, no, no. Your hoes want to see Halloween delay, do Halloween. Or at least Halloween colors. I'm not going to do like all that scary shit. I don't know what I was going to do to this nail, so I'm just going to put top coat on it already. Probably going to put bling on it. Most likely. All right, hold on. I have like hella scratch right here on my nail. That's not letting it. Look, you guys can, I don't know if you guys can see it, but I guess I didn't buff that little piece right there that you could see the scratches. Fuck it, we'll just put bling on it. I was going to do it again, but I'm like, eh, nah. They are waiting for me to watch Cobra Kai. I cannot. So that's why sometimes I can't be on live forever because my child and my husband want to spend some time with me. But this is my job. Doing content for you guys is my job. Hanging out. Well, I make it my job. Fuck it. Let's put top coat on all of them. Might as well. We already here. We already started top coating shit. So might as well. <laughs> you missed when I was webbing. It's because it's so fast. I use spider gel. I'll check to see if we have any more spider gels. And then if we do, we will. I'll restock it. But I do have another batch of spider gel coming. I used it up on my scoops. I'm sorry, guys. Yes, it's your job. We love you. Oh, thank you. All right, let me zoom it in. I mean, let me stick it in. So meanwhile, I cure my nails. Make sure to tap the screen, guys. Tap the screen. Mine as well. Mm -hmm. Can you add pink glitter spider gel to the website? Can you add pink glitter spider gel? Actually, you can. So you can add glitter to your spider gel like on top. That's what I did last time. So if you guys would like to do glitter, I would recommend to use the clear one. I have the, the clear gold. Irid no, the, I don't fucking know what it's called. I think it's called clear gold spider gel. Before you cure it in the lamp, you could throw glitter on it and then cure it. 
So I'll do another. Do pink glam Halloween nails. Oh my god. I actually just saw a super cute design. That Cheyenne's nails did last year. That I would like to recreate. Let me see if I can pull it up. It's a pink Halloween. I saw it earlier and I'm like, oh my god. Those are so cute. Let me see if I can pull it up real quick. I haven't recreated a set from somebody in a long time. So definitely I need to screenshot this so I can recreate it. And oh shit, what the fuck did I type? Hold on. I'll recreate it and look, this set. So cute. I don't know if you guys can see. It's pink and it has ghosts. I love ghosts. So I guess she did one hand nude and red. Another one is pink and black. Oh, that is so cute. Obviously, I'd put bling on it, but they're so cute. I, oh, yeah, I already saved it. I already saved it. What's her TikTok? Um, I, I went on Instagram. I don't know if she has a TikTok, actually. She probably does. Okay, my nails are nice and dry. So let me pop out my spider. All right, so I am gonna, I'll probably put my spider up here. So I'm just gonna scratch it a little bit right there. Y'all gonna be like, bitch, you just fucking put top coat. But let me tell you, anything on a rough surface always sticks better. I'm going to pray to the nail gods that I get spider gel in my scoops. All right, so I'm going to do a pretty big motherfucking spider because fuck it, go big on home, bitch. So we're going to rub that bitch. Roll it, I mean. Her Instagram is Cheyenne's Cheyenne Nails. It's funny because if you guys would have got spider gel, if you guys got spider gel last time, you're probably like, what the fuck is this? I don't want this shit or whatever. But now that Zile taught you how to use it, you're like, I want it. I need it. Okay, hold on. But don't worry. That's, that's what the scoops are all about. You guys getting things you never used before. So let's see. I think I'm going to. Oh, wait. This fucking looks like a top. I thought it was round. So I'm going to stick it in the lamp right now. Let me just make it round. I don't know why my thing's not going round. It's like more oval. Fuck it. I'm just going to do it like that. Let me put it to cure. It looks like a black m and Alright, I'm going to cure it. And like I was teaching, uh, teaching you guys last time. Um, you have to cure it all around because gel needs to be fully cured. So that's why I'm not applying it to my nail. Is my fucking thing dying? No. That's why I'm I'm not doing it directly onto my nail because I want it to be fully, fully dry. I got black spider gel on my last scoop, so it's so cool. Yes, honey. Are you afraid the oils from your fingers will compromise a product in the spider? Um, no, I've been doing it like this and nothing happened. But you just want to make sure that you cure the full body of the of anything that you make. So the light has to hit everything. Every side. Let me see if I, my little ice creams are in here. Where did I leave them? Oh, yeah. The other day we made some foods. Let's like, check it out. This is what we made last time with the with the sculpting gels, and you have to cure every fucking angle. Okay, it's kind of like top coat or any gel. If the light doesn't hit it, it's not gonna cure. Are we cooking? No, we're not going to cook today. We're making a spider. Okay, I'm learning so much. That's why I love your lives. Yes, Jasmine. Well, welcome, girlfriend. I try my best to educate y'all. 
with everything. So it's like bake. we're baking here. Let me put it in there a little bit more. Meanwhile, actually, I do the head. I forgot. Spiders have heads. So the head wants to be a little bit, a little bit smaller. And one thing, though, that you want to do is make sure that your, your hands are pretty clean. So because I'm using a black color, the dust or whatever is not that noticeable. But if you were using white, you'd see all the fucking knit if you don't wash your hands. My little one is saying she likes your nails so far. Ah, okay, pues. Little K16. Más te vale. All right, me going to put my... My cabecita in the lamp. Spiders have heads and like 20 eyes. Damn. She's waiting to see the spider. Spiders have heads. <laughs> I hate spiders. Normally when I see a spider, I fucking yell like a little bitch. Mm-mm-mm. Hell nah. All right. So let me... Put this one on here. Let me see if that's even a good head. Yeah, it's gonna have a big, a big booty. I like big butts in a can of night. Okay, let's see. Hi everyone, do a bling spider. I was actually going to put bling in a spider, but I also have these bling charms. Bling, I mean, yeah. Spider blings or whatever the hell that I'm going to be using. So I would like one of these to pop pop out. I'll probably use the silver and red. Or maybe this little one. I don't know. But this is going to be the baby and the other one's going to be the mama. Oh my gosh, look guys, I was just telling you guys about the dust. Where did you guys get dust? From my table? <sighs> my head got full of dust. Fuck it. Fuck it, it's part of their web. Fuck it, no time to make another one. Fuck it, thug like. All right, let me get my glue so I can glue them on real quick. All right, so I'm going to glue the body first. Will the spiders be in the nail art scoops? Um, Yeah, I'm going to add some of the nail art charms. I mean, the Halloween charms. Zule, do you have those charms in your store? Yes, I do. I will be adding a few of them to the scoops as well. Where's my activator at? And tomorrow, I'm going to try to see if I could get some more activator for you guys. Because we've been sold out for like a month already. It looks like I have an m, &M lane on my nail. I'm going to put the head right here. Y luego ahorita le hacemos las patas. So I'm going to add a little bit more glue down here. So it could sit better. Imagine you see a spider this big. What would you do? That looks like a Skittle, right? It looks like a little fucking M&M to me. All right, guys. <laughs> I'm kind of nervous. Let's do some legs. How did I do the pinky nail? I just added glitter on it. Black and then glitter. Is anybody else's live lagging? 
Or is it just mine on my other phone? Oh, shit. I'm using the Mia Secret Activator. It, it, how to call it? Hold on, I'm trying to find a spot for my lamp so I could put it on my table. Not mine, spray it with rain. <laughs> mine keeps lagging. Yeah, my phone that I'm watching the live with is lagging a little bit. Okay. So let's make some legs. Mine was lagging a little bit, but not too much. All right, I'm going to make a couple legs. Mine keeps loading. You keep freezing. Have to keep leaving, then coming back. Yeah, mine froze earlier, but not no more. Yeah, you're freezing hella. Man, I should have never said nothing. Okay, let me end the live and come back. Hopefully that works, okay? Not a couple. Spider has six legs. <laughs> Zule, why does the activator turn white? It should not be turning white. If, if yours is turning white, you're probably spraying it too close or something, but that's never happened to me. Okay, let me end it and come back really quickly because my shit is lagging a lot. Hold on, I'll be back. <clears throat> Hello, welcome back. We'll get back. Hola, estoy haciendo unas patitas de spiders. So I made one right now and I bent it a little bit. little leg i'm not sure if this one is a spider leg or not that should be looking like a fucking cucaracha leg loki let me see if this is too big no i broke it what's the sticker for um just so that it doesn't get stuck bish Pinches patrullas de la pinche spider. No mames. Spiders have eight legs. Bish. I don't know if I'm about to be doing eight legs. Maybe I should stick them on. Oh. I know they're like long and skinny. Mine's only going to have fucking... Three on each side. Oh, shit. I cut it. All right. What the fuck do spider legs look like? Oh, no. I did it backwards. Sorry. Sorry, Spidey. I never really draw spiders, so I don't fucking know. <laughs> Spiders, stay in your place. You bitch. I think I'm just gonna have to draw them. Fuck this shit. It's not staying. Yeah, 
It's hard to do it on yourself. Andale pinche pata. Paint them. I know. I think I am. Fuck that shit. Stressing me out already. <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna paint the legs. Fuck this bitch. And mm -mm -mm. let me find my black gel real quick so to paint these legs. Pinche spider malita for real. Let me just put it right here. We don't like stressed azule. I know. I'm like, oh, honey, why are you doing this to me? I'm going to use my little. Okay. Um... Let me see if I could even paint. I said six, I think it's definitely eight. Cure the legs first. I'm just gonna paint the stupid legs. Fuck this spider. I couldn't even, let me see. Spider pig, spider pig. You can paint on the Black Widow sign on its body, too. Ooh. Spider pig does what spider pig does. A ver. I'm the nipping just spider pig. I'm trying to do a long little patita because this bitch is humongous. Humongous. Now you selling como la flor on your website, girl. It's bomb. You need it in your life. Hold on. Should I just do a little one here? Let me cure this before I fuck it up. It's bomb. If you guys have not tried como la flor, hmm, hmm, hmm. you missing out, girl. You could be twitching in five seconds. You should have used black bling for the spider body. Eight legs. My charms only have six. What has three and three? I can't with you, Zule. Oh. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> That's the whiskers. Fuck, man. Oh, well. Now it's going to have all kinds of legs. This one's a mutated spider. I'll do... And this one's going to have 10 legs. Fuck it. She's half spider, half something else. Pinch spider mamona. Those could be fangs. Uh-huh. <laughs> I've been married almost 14 years. 14 years, I just twitch now. <laughs> yeah, honey. And then she lost a leg on the other side. Mm-hmm. All right, I don't fucking know. Fuck the spider. I cannot draw for shit. So this spider gonna be throwing gang signs, all right? And y'all better not fucking laugh. This one has a longer arm than the other one, and it's totally okay. It's a Nemo. It's a Nemo spider. All right. I'm going to put as a prize a Como La Flor again, so you guys can fight for it. I 
I love your spider better than what I can do. She, I don't really do spiders on my clients. So that's why it's be looking a little fugly. But it's okay. We're not about perfection here. We are about having fun and positivity. You know, we got to show the, the folks that we're not perfect. We fuck shit up too. And it's okay. It looks pretty good. Just on zoom in. As someone who owns a pest control company, your spider is gorgeous. Ooh, yes, honey. Thank you. You're going to make me feel good about my spidey. It's nice. She good. Amiga, can you do a chaton placement video? Porfis. I actually check out the video of these nails. I did this one on my live. It's on my YouTube channel. Just see it from afar. We good. And the lens ain't those ain't Yeah, it looks pretty good from far. Zam, there's like a little burnt um what is it called? Skittle on your nails, Lane. Music to my what? Everyone doing Halloween nails. I love it. We I'm being forced by my viewers to do Halloween. So the reason why a lot of people have been doing Halloween nails right now is to start giving inspo to people. You know, normally that's what we do. Normally that's what we do. We do them in advance to give you guys inspiration. He needs eyes. How many Comola Flor are you putting in the scoops? Just one. Well, I'm actually, I'm just kidding. I'm not going to put one. So we got a spin wheel. And it, we could give away like three or four or many, all five of them. And that's what it lands in, you know? He needs a lot of eyes now. Ooh, that's so nasty. Okay, let me pop on my white gel. Oh my God, I'm going to have to stare at this thing. With all those eyes. Red glitter on top of the spider. Okay, I'm going to do the eyes. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Um, Post your comment again. All right, let me. I made a reference picture. Let me look. Let me look online. No me vean el porno, eh? Um, spider. Spider with... Ooh. Oh, they look disgusting. Ew, look at those hairy things. Disgusting. Uh-uh. I'm gonna put cartoon one. Cartoon spider. Those are kind of cuter. <laughs> that one's cute. So I'm just gonna put four like this one, I guess. They have too many fucking eyes, Felicia. Look, that one has a lot of legs. One, two, three, four, five, six, twelve legs. Yeah, I guess I'm going to do it like like this one. A baddie spider. I'm going to hold on. Oh, you guys wanted me to bling out the eyes? Zule, look at us. Sorry. <laughs> oh, for bling eyes. Bitch, y'all making me draw me here. I could have been doing a bling eye. Sorry. Everyone says bling eyes. Okay, sorry. It's because I was over here stressing out. How many eyes do I got to draw? 
when I am painting, I forget about everything else. I'm over here trying to not fail. <laughs> okay, okay, bling, bling, bling. Okay, we'll do bling, bling ice. Fuck. We should have said that sooner because I was already sweating. Like, <laughs> don't fuck up the eyes, Ule. Don't fuck them up. Ooh, red bling eyes. Let me see if I have little red ones. <sighs> okay, I'm sweating. I'm sweating. Let me put away my shit now. We don't need none of this no more. All right, let me pop out my bling a ling 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 ling. I don't think I'm going to paint anything else anymore. I'm just going to be adding some bling right now. Um, let's see. Let's get these little eyes on. Oh, shit, it fell. Should I make my spider cross-sided? Can people not tell a woman's voice from a man? <laughs> they probably can't hear me. I'm going to put four eyes. Everyone peep that comment, right? What they say? That I have a man voice? Motherfucker. I am a man, bitch. Ooh, it looks like a little crown. Per, I'm not blocking. Maybe just confused. So educate you. How? Se ve muy padre. She said, is this a man doing his nails? Look, was it a guy or a girl saying that? Hold on, let me clean my nail. I'm not sure if I touched something. A girl got me cracking up. Oh my God. No, I'm not a man, honey. All right, I'm gonna add my bling to my nail already. I'm going to do some big red bling, sexy red bling. The baby bling spider on the big M&M. &M. <laughs> it's not an M&M, &M, but it looks like one, huh? I wish I will see you files those from a square to point. I will be posting that on my YouTube channel soon. Fuck, it dried on me already. And I didn't even file nothing. All right, let's see. What are the shape? What are the shape? Should I put on this one? They looking badass, huh? I'm just going to do the biggest blings I got. I don't have too many reds, so this is what I'm going to be adding. Bling-a-ling, bling-a-ling. Really? I got muted for something stupid before, but they let that slide? What are you talking about? Oh, about the man person? They call me a man? Look, ladies, don't be fighting in here. Don't be fighting, Coco Bunny. Oh. 
Oh, I wish. Oh, I don't have a bigger one. I do. I do. Hey, 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 B. Should I put black on this nail? Do you guys think I should add some black crystals on here and just keep it all red? How long have you been doing nails? I've been doing nails. Put red bling on her back. Okay, I'll put some red bling. Yes, red entertaining. Yes, add black. No, just red. Red and black. Black. No, all red. Yes, I have black. It's my black ones. Red and black. Red and black. I have black. I have black. Okay, I do have black bling, actually. I'll add a little red dot. A little red diamond to its back right now. Um... Let me bring my black bling over here. So this is what I was using to bedazzle my hat the other day. My Disney hat, just in case you are, are gonna be like, what is that? Look at my black bling I have. Woo! I have it in this giant tray, so that's where I'm gonna be grabbing it from. Are these from Amazon? No, ma'am. These are Swarovskis. I don't have black shapes. Damn, this one's too big. But a red hourglass one on the back of the spider. An hourglass. I thought just by putting one little diamond, like a little butt, poles, red shapes. Okay, never mind. Do you have a video of doing the spider? Back up. Can we see? Oh, sorry, 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 sorry. Hold on. Let me get some more bling in my bin. So I can move this out the way. All right, hold on. It's because this tray is too big and I don't fit in my desk. Okay. Zule, cuando estás chupi chupi, that spider gonna look at your man's. <laughs> what are we doing a poll for? To take off the black bling? What's the poll for? What do you wanna do a poll for? Just two red blings, one small. She never sees the back black widow. Yodo, you should be a comedian. I am a comedian, girlfriend. Oh, to put two dots. Red and black pole. I just purchased my scoop. I had to use my credit card to my husband. Don't do your transactions. Okay. What am I doing the pole? On this nail? Do you have a video of doing the spider? I will have a video once we're done here. Okay. Love them. Look up Black Widow images. Do a diamond in the spider. I don't have that shape. If I had a little red one, I could have put it there like. Pew. That one's too big. I'm just going to put two little dots. Bling out the spider with black crystals. Damn, y'all want me to be here all day, huh? All right, I'm just going to keep bedazzling. I'm going to keep bedazzling my nail. Meanwhile... I wanted to do a full black nail. Do see less see 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 see. No 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 coco no coco no. 
Not the missile is a good gun. No, no, no. Yes, we do for you. Oh, shit. What happened to my diamond? I'm starting to feel like this nail's looking like fucking. Um, what is it called? The fucking movie. Como se llama? The, 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 win no, Alice in Wonderland. Yeah, we want to keep you here all day. We need our Zule fix. I know, I know, I know, I know. I know. Quieren que le ponga fully bling bling a la pinche spider. Se pasan, amigas, se pasan. Quiero ver que quiero ir a ver Cobra Kai. This looks so pretty. Thank you. Thank you, my friends. I'm not a big fan of black, but I'm just doing it for y'all. Um, I do not have this bling box available because I filled it up myself. These are my personal stash of Swarovski crystals. But I do have some available on my website that you can buy individually. I don't have a large variety of them anymore, but... I am going to add a few more that for my personal stock. For those of you guys who are interested, I have came to my senses and I don't need that much bling in my life. Just two red blings on her back like the eyes. Black is my favorite color besides blue. Um, I like black only around Halloween time. I'm going to add more red. Coat the whole... Ooh, I don't have black glitter, girl. Who am I that I don't have black glitter, huh? I think last year you guys were telling me something with black glitter too, and I just did not have it. I don't know what the fuck kind of... Look, Loki, this is like a fucking spider. That's the body and that's the head and the little arms. I like black 365 days a, way, uh, a year, I mean. I know, I wear black too, a lot. But, okay, I'm just going to put two little dots. One bigger than the other. That's going to be the Black Widow shenanigan. I don't know what these look like because I never want to see one in my life. But that's as good as it's going to get, okay? That's her butt. I love black. My whole room is black. But the nail area is white and gold. Okay. Okay, let's see what else we can do to these nails. What else? What other charm I can add? You know, because I love charms. I love to get my hair pulled. I was thinking of even putting one of these stupid hands. Like, ooh, let's kill it on. Maybe I should put in my pinky. It pops more. Do you think I should put this on my... Or my thumb? Nah, fuck my thumb. I think I'm gonna put it... Oh, sorry. On my end right here. On my pinky would look nice, huh? The pinky, the pinky in the brain, the pinky in the brain. All right, I'm just gonna put a blob of glue. Last time I glued my charm on with cluster gel, but I do not want to take it out. I'm just going to put it a little sideways. Add one on the thumb. What kind of glue is that? This is the best glue in the universe, ma'am. It's labeling adhesive. I love black on my clothing as well. But... Um, not really on nails. 
where you get the spray from this is the oh fuck you can't even see the label it's me a secret activator you can find it anywhere on your local nail supply you could even find it on amazon normally i have it on my store but i have not been able to get my hands on it it's been out of stock forever hopefully tomorrow i could go get some more I'm just gonna add like a little trace of bling. I'm gonna have to do my nails tonight. Now I'm inspired this. Ay, que bueno, amiga. I'm just gonna add a little bit of red bling because I feel like it looks sexy. Sexy, un momento. Sexy. I don't even know como va la pinche canción. Es una bomba. Something, 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 something. Algo así va la canción, ¿verdad? Uh, sometimes I just put like random as bling. I don't even fucking think of what to put. I just put it. Like boom. Boom, 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 boom. Like and like so pretty, so pretty. And then the poor little thumb is sad once again. Maybe I should put a stupid spider on the thumb, huh? Um, should I put a spider on it or should I just put the skull? The hand belongs to the skull. Fuck. Should I put the skull? Or the spider? The skull, the spider, the skull, the spider, the red spider, not spider. Yes, skull. Okay, do a poll. I think you guys like the polls. All right, we're going to do a poll. Fuck. Why is it so dark in my thing? All right, let's do a poll. So the red is going to be for the spider and the crime face is going to be the skull. So if you guys want the spider, you're going to put the happy face. The skull is the sad face. A ver, who's going to win? Who's going to win? Who's going to win? Who's going to win? Look, I even have a spider. Uh, uh, a pumpkin okay um the spider's a red one huh that's what i said it was maybe i should put a little baby right here like hey girlfriend like hey girlfriend <laughs> okay spider it is winner winner chicken dinner Come on, Skull. <laughs> Would you have what? Would I have what? Bling at the spider, please. No, amiga, no podemos bling, bling, bling el spider. Have them in the store. Yes, we. all of these charms are available on the store already. Um, They've been on there for a few days now. I just hadn't really told you guys about them. I did post it on my Instagram, actually. Okay, so I guess the spider wins. Maybe another day I'll do a skull. I've actually been wanting to do a set with a skull. The skull, so. I'm going to do that. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Hold on. For sure, if I put it towards the tip, it's going to annoy the shit out of me. I'm just going to put it right here. And I'm going to put it with my bling adhesive as well. Is there anywhere where you can still get Swarovski boxes like that? You can. Nobody sells them in boxes, Coco Bunny. It's too expensive to sell in a box. I don't. I mean, I mean, I'm sure somebody sells boxes, but not as 
big as this one. This right here could be almost like a grand of bling. So you just have to collect them all. Do you cure the glue? No, it dries with the activator or se seca solo. So I'm going to go ahead and add a little bit more right here in the legs. Pa que no me jale la greña. Because ain't nobody trying to pull hair with these or my bed or bed sheets. So I'm just kind of trying to put it in between. <gasps> oh, shit. In between the legs. Okay, hold on. The activator is so that it it um freezes in place. Yes, like Paige said, if you want your bling to dry fast, you you can apply it directly onto acrylic. Right now, I am using it over top coat, so it will dry a little bit slower. So, let's see. I'm going to add a little bit of bling here. I'm going to add, like, three little diamonds. I normally like to apply it directly to my acrylic because it dries faster, but... Since I already put top coat, I need the spray. I need it. I need it. You should add red cl red clusters. I did want to do a cluster actually, but I'm like, do I have a nail? I sure do. Maybe on my next Halloween set, I'll do a cluster. You know, we got to keep having ideas for a next set. Because these are not going to last forever. Y'all already know. In three days. We're going to switch them out. So I'm just going to do something kind of simple. Nothing too crazy. For the thumb. No, please do a cluster. I don't have another finger for a cluster. If I do a cluster, it's going to clash with my spider. I've done that before where I have two big things. And then they be clashing. Like, they'll bump into each other and it ain't gonna last. I promise next time I will do a cluster. If you guys remind me ahead of time. All right, let me just spray all just in case. Do you use anything to make your nails healthy? No, I do not do nothing to them. I just make sure that I soak them properly each and every time I remove them. That's all I do. So let me put on my rings. I need a fucking spider ring is what I need. I'm not going to put any cuticle oil. Because I'm a crusty bitch like that. Is that the putona glitter? Of course, honey. Of course. It's la putona glitter. Ooh, he thought me caben mis rings. I need to put everything on my nails. One more red bling on the back of the spider. Ay, no, ya no, ya no, ya no. Ya no les voy a poner, sorry. Ya me puse los anillos y ya cerré la caja. I even put the butterfly bucket. Putona means like bad bitch. <laughs> like a hoe. Hoe red. Pinches de dos gordos malditos que me cargo. So these are the nails of the night. I hope you guys like them. I'm going to go record them. I mean, my rings, they are from from um Gia accessories. I will be tagging her on my Instagram. I think I have other rings. I'm going to go look for them right now. Why lines delay? You're going to get these girls in trouble. No butterfly. I I don't want to put the butterfly, but I need more rings. I even have La Virgencita. 
The bling box is not for sale. It's too much, honey. Too much. It will cost an arm and a leg. And I would not trust USPS with that shit. Ooh, you did. Never mind. Mm -hmm. Word of the day delay. Okay, so word of the day is putona. All right. Putona means big hoe. I had a client tell me cuticle oil causes lifting. I've never heard of that before. Well, it only causes lifting if it's already lifted. You know, Zulego, Chupi Chupi. No, we're going to go watch TV. What the hell? For real, the, the stiletto was such perfect shape for these, right? They look so... All right, guys. So, I will see you guys soon on Sunday, to be exact. Don't forget to purchase your scoops um, before Sunday if you haven't already done so. Um, do you offer subscription package? No, actually, I think our subscription package is kind of like our scoops, huh? That's like our specials. So if you guys, my fishes group name is Putonas. Oh my god. Oh no, we restarted the live. That's why. We only have 8,000 likes. We started it like a little bit ago. So I'll see you guys on Sunday. Make sure to get your drinks and all that because we're going to be there for a long time. I'll see you guys on Sunday. Don't forget to go show me some love on these nails because, bitch, I'm about to be all weekend with this fucking spider on my nail. Mm -mm. Felicia, bye. Gift cards. I haven't looked for the gift cards yet. Set alarms for Sunday, 5 p.m. Yes, ma'am. Thank you very much. I'll keep talking to you guys tomorrow um, on my Instagram. So make sure to follow me on Instagram. If you don't already follow me, go to be be if, if you have to get money for Sunday. <laughs> yeah. All right. Bye, everyone. Have a good night. Sweet dreams. Don't let the bed bugs bite. Bye. Más, y copas de más, tú no me dejas en paz, de mi mente no te va.